Emerson and welcome to the WEMS. Today is Friday, October 20th. I'm Bruno from Home Room 109. And I'm Andrew from Home Room 174. Students, please stand and face the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Students, please be seated for 15 seconds of silence. We've loved seeing you in your Red Ribbon Week spirit wear this week. We're going to turn it over to the Red Ribbon Week committee for a special announcement. Hey Emerson, thanks for participating this year in Red Ribbon Week activities. We hope you enjoyed dressing up and having a couple of treats at lunch. And today we are celebrating all of our unique styles, so thank you again for participating. And at Emerson, we are all unique, we embrace each other's differences, and that's what makes us awesome eagles. Because we are... Thanks to everyone who participated in Pink Out Day. With your help, we raised $416.67. Now the moment you have all been waiting for, the raffle winners. The winners of the $5 Starbucks gift cards are Emma F. in Home Room 109, CJH in Home Room 01, Francesca B. in Home Room 214, Evie W. in Home Room 09, and Gosum F. in Home Room 214. Pick up your gift card from the office. On Wednesday, November 2nd, we encourage you to bring a plastic free lunch to school. Let's turn it over to Starry Studios for tips on how to get back an environmental sustainable lunch. At District 64, we believe that it is best to minimize our waste. So to, to do this, we should pack our lunches from home. It's good for the planet and saves us money. Use reusable containers instead of Ziploc bags. Use reusable silverware instead of plastic ones. Use cloth napkins instead of paper napkins. And use metal water bottles instead of plastic water bottles. Reduce. Reuse. And if you can't do that, recycle. Thanks for the tips, Leo and Caroline. Now for this month's Book in a Jar answer. It is Scary Stories to Tow in the Dark by Alvin Schwartz. Look for prices in Homeroom and get a new book in the year starting next week. This is a small part of Rosanine Zombies performed by the Philharmonic Orchestra. Come join us, Concert Orchestra, String Ensemble, and Chamber Orchestra for a concert on Thursday, November 3rd. The concert starts at 7 and feel free to wear a Halloween costume, but please don't wear a hat or a mask that covers your full face. We hope to see you at our spectacular Strings event in the gym. Emerson students, wrestling season is here. Watch this promotional video by News Palette, Splatter, and Drift TV. Are you interested in wrestling? Do you want to get stronger? Do you want to make new friends? If so, then join the Emerson Wrestling Program. Sign up for the wrestling informational meeting Thursday, November 3rd at 3.05 at the School Fitness Center. Wrestling is open to all grade levels. If you have any questions, see Mr. Marks in the art room. We are hoping for a strong turnout on November 3rd after school in the fitness center. All grade levels are welcome to join and we are looking for wrestlers of all sizes. Now, let's turn it over to Alex for this weekend's weather report. Today we have a high of 57 degrees with partly cloudy skies. T tomorrow the high will be 62 degrees with mostly sunny skies. On Sunday, we will have showers during the afternoon with a high of 61 degrees. Now I'm going to turn it over to Senor Zasti with a special announcement. Buenos dias, Aguilas, or Eagles. We're going to be talking a little bit about the Day of the Dead. The Day of the Dead, or Dio de los Muertos in Spanish, is a Mexican holiday celebrated over multiple days, November 1st and November 2nd. It involves family and friends gathering to pray for and remember friends and family members who have died. Day of the Dead, Dia de los Muertos, is not about being scared or mourning, but rather celebrating the spirit and memories of loved ones. 
please stop by the LRC to see the amazing ofrenda made by Mrs. Saget and write a message if you'd like in honor of one of your loved ones who has passed. Our shout outs go to the Bulldogs team. Remember, Eagles, we are Emerson! And remember, Eagle, we are Emerson! Why didn't you say that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>